di satu yang hujan lalu lintas cukup padat, tapi tidak mengerungkan semangat para pesepeda motor ini. Mereka anggota Women in the Wind. On a bike is a sense of freedom. Where you can put all the stresses behind. Women in the Wind merupakan organisasi internasional pengendara motor khusus perempuan yang beranggotakan sekitar 14.000 orang. Anggota Women in the Wind di sekitar Washington DC tergabung dalam chapter bernama Diamond Roses. Coming up with mommy duties, wife duties, I wanted to do something for myself. It's gotten me out of the house and it's gotten me to pick a hobby that I can do by myself. I'm 64 years old. I am a grandmother of three. I decided I wanted to step outside of the box, so I bought myself a cam man. A lot of people tell me I can't ride because I'm too short. There's no bike that fit me, and that kind of got me interested. Just to prove that if you really put your mind to it, you can accomplish anything. Namun bukan berarti tanpa tantangan. I got mixed reactions, and those reactions were no. Are you sure? Be careful of the people that you associating with. Ini karena prasangka yang mengidentikan pengendara motor dengan tindak kriminal atau geng. Karenanya anggota Diamond Roses ingin menepis stigma tersebut. We ride with a purpose to honor somebody or uh, sometimes we lay le- uh, wreaths at the Arlington Cemetery. Um, you know, we do a lot of charity work. Walaupun tidak sedikit anggota Women in the Wind yang berkendara dengan laki-laki, lebih banyak yang memilih untuk bersolo. The camaraderie, the sisterhood. You walk into a place like our one of our conventions and there are two, three, four hundred people there. You have two, three, four hundred instant best friends. A lot of guys are riding it for sport, for the trail, for the ego. But when you ride with a group of women, it's different. It's just more peaceful, more calm, more sa- safer. There's no ego involved. Di negara di mana pengendara motor cukup jarang terlihat, Women in the Wind memberikan kesan tersendiri. Dari Washington DC, tim VOA.